Don't forget to press the subscribe button and click the bell icon to stay up to date with all our videos. Hey everyone, so welcome back to Ramtha Education and I hope you guys are doing great. Take care of yourself in this situation, stay at home and yeah, please take care. Alright, so first of all what we need to do here is to install the react project using Gatsby so what are we gonna do is we need to go to gatsbyjs.org and from there we need to go into the quick start and if you guys haven't installed Gatsby CLI you might have to do this I have already installed it so all I need to do is Gatsby new and yeah, let me do that CD and gets be new shirt app we'll just name it this one and by the time it's gonna load pretty quick it's gonna be in 45 seconds but I'll let you know what we are going to use for state management here so we'll use context API I don't recommend for big projects but at least for small projects this is like well and good and people have suggested that context API is not that powerful as Redux right now but yeah down the road it might because the the guy who created Redux is working for Facebook right now Dan Abron Debro I guess Dan Abramo yeah so he's the guy who created Redux and he is going Back, he went to into Facebook and now he's working with Facebook so he's familiar with these things and he should be making things better all right so we will be using context to store our orders and we will be using ent design and also react router let me go to react router dome so this one we are going to install it using npm install create react dome okay so if this is done all right so cd share tab and i'm gonna go and yarn install react router dome all right yarn it's not supposed to be installed let's add okay so this is something which we'll be using also and design so let me go to and design I'll show you what exactly are we gonna be using from here but yep let's go to and design get started and here all we need is yarn add and D all right yarn add and D Okay, so by the time, let me even cd document, open the code in, con in VS Code. Ramto education and shirt app. Okay, code dot. All right, so this is done. The good thing is it's getting really quick. So, Gatsby. If you want to start the server, you need to do get speed develop. You can even check that on the official documentation that you need to go into your folder and then just run get speed develop. So I'm just going to copy paste it. So let me get speed develop and that's pretty much it to start the server. And this server is going to be on localhost 8000. So it won't start on its own so you need to just copy and paste it it will uh, because it's still loading so okay we'll give it some time but by that time I'm gonna install and this I guess I did right uh, design yes we did okay great so if we go into the react router we'll go to the basic example which is for routing is going to be this component so route it has a router it has the link and it has these routes 
if you are not familiar with react router you can take a look but this link is kind of a anchor anchor tag so which is going to take you to this particular route and so it's going to be facebook.com slash facebook.com slash about facebook.com slash users and every route will have its own component so we'll be using this once I get this thing up and running and luckily this is up so you'll see a basic boilerplate here so if you see something like this that means that it's working great all right so if I go into the project I'm already in the project so in this project we have in the SRC we have three things three folders one is a component one is images and the third one is the pages so if you are familiar with create react app you might have seen the app js so in Gatsby it is our pages and index index.js is the main file which is exposed from the back to so this is a file which you will be using basically okay so inside of this I'm gonna copy and paste the router thing so I'm gonna copy and paste the whole thing here let's do this alright so we might even have to install or not install but import browser so for that I'm gonna directly import it from copy and paste okay we don't have we don't really care about these components anymore and index is working good we don't have this about so h1 about h1 users and h1 home okay so it shouldn't be having any issues with the linting I'm hoping everything is fine it's just taking its delay yeah okay so if I there you go okay about users and home this is working great and I think we have the end design in the background as well okay so let's get rid of this guy even orders I'll change it to orders because what we need here is we need uh, if you guys don't exactly know what we are working on let me take you back to the design and the design is gonna be that on the nav bar we will have shirt app and here we will have the orders button and this will be the component which is gonna be rendering again like toggling between itself okay so it's this one this is what I'm talking about and this will be another component as well okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stop this video because there was some issue in the recording I recorded the previous video and it didn't it didn't work and I had to re-record it so yeah let me uh, stop this video and I'll see if it works but yeah I'll see you in the next video and take care bye